What is up, my frosty brethren? My name is Arctic. Today is Thursday, and that means we got some Gears of War uh, today. Look, I know Rod Ferguson made the announcement that there's no Marcus Phoenix collection, okay? We can stop the speculation. We can stop talking about that. But he did, however, also say that uh, they're working on some other Gears projects. Now, last week, and I think in one of my previous Gears of War 4 discussion videos, I talked about the possibility of there being a Marcus Phoenix, Phoenix collection, mostly because I feel like, and I still feel like this, that uh, Black Tusk is mirroring in a lot of ways what 343 is doing. So um, the reason I think that there's, it, it could be a remaster of something, it could be some other Gears game that's awfully related to you know the new Gears of War to kind of reintroduce people since it's going to be a little time lapse. I just feel like there's been enough time between uh, the games that they're going to introduce something uh, relatively soon that I think people can kind of bite and chew and and hold them off until Gears the the new Gears Gears of War Four whatever it's going to be called is created. Now, uh, you know there's some people I think there's a a group of people that are against either a remaster or uh, obviously the, the Marcus Phoenix collection, whatever the case may be, I think they're against that because I've seen comments where people are like, no, they shouldn't really be working on that. They should just be focusing on Gears of War 4. Totally respect that. Uh, very valid point. I, I think that, uh, you know, they need to have all hands on deck. At the same time, like I said, I feel like there's this growing sense of, I don't know if it's urgency or if it's just, uh, you know, people feel like they miss the game. It seems like there's growing uh, a consensus around trying to either play Gears of War 3 or go back and play the game again uh, or just have something to fill that void for next-gen consoles. And I also know a lot of you guys, especially some subs on my channel, have specifically told me I'm not I'm not buying a next-gen console until Gears of War is out, until the new one is out. I'm just not doing it, right? So, I, you know, I think there's, there's some very... Um, hardcore fans that uh, would like to play the game and it's totally understandable i'm wondering what these other projects are if they're gears related um you know i don't i don't know how much of uh you know they're going to try i guess how much you're going to try to deviate from uh gears if it's going to be some uh, like another gears judgment or if it's going to be uh, some different different type of genre or if it's going to be something like Halo Online, which was announced for Russia. Um, and it's I think it's free to play and it's being made by another developer. I don't know if they're thinking about something like that where they're like, OK, let's just introduce it to another region that we know is hot. That'll pick up the game and play it and then get people talking about Gears again. I'm not sure what the plan is, but I think they definitely have a course of action that they're going to take. And uh, obviously, you know, Rod's other portion of that is that they're going to show some stuff at E3. So, yes, we're going to get something. We're going to get something at E3. I don't know what that is exactly, but, uh, you know, I think that uh, for a lot of folks, this well, next two months, uh, basically leading up to E3, is going to be a lot of anticipation and a lot of speculation on what exactly uh, we're gonna, going to get. Last thing I want to mention and uh, I was giving them uh, a, a, kind of a hard time, but I think Skyless was more so than me. Uh, Strangulate, who is on one of my teams I like the most, Synergy, of the new school uh, Gears of War 3 teams. Uh, he's starting a uh, video series. I'm going to link his channel in the description, uh, Running Ranked. Um, and I don't, he didn't know that I, I did a Running Ranked stuff, but, uh, you know, we were kind of giving him uh, some, some shit for it. But... Um, Go over to his channel. I know you guys definitely want gears. I don't particularly. I don't post a whole lot of gears anymore. So I know 30, 30,000 of my thirty-five thousand uh, subs are like gears, hardcore gears heads, and that's all they want to see. So Strangulate is uh, posting uh, some videos. He is very, very good at the game. I think you guys can appreciate uh, his gameplay. I don't know how how good his commentary skills are, but uh, I, I know that he is an excellent player, and I think you guys can enjoy his gameplay so hope you guys enjoyed today's video let me know what you think about rod's tweet i know it's a week old or whatever but hey i posted my video and then he immediately uh or i finished my video i should say and he immediately tweeted thereafter and i couldn't i was like i'm not changing it it's, it's too late so it is what it is i'm talking about it now let me know what you think and i'll catch you guys later stay frosty now if you've enjoyed the video 
made it this far, leave a like if you've not already. It really helps me out and I really appreciate your support. Subscribe if you've not already so you guys can check my next video. And if you've missed anything, especially this video right here, go check it out. Just click, 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 click.